Hello everyone. Welcome to Snippet Nugget. And in this video, we are going to discuss a very common problem that occurs with the eclipse. So the problem is when we start the eclipse and try to open the workspace, it gives us the error that please choose another workspace as any particular workspace is currently in use. And this is one of the very common error which uh, is generally faced. So let us understand that what is the actual reason for this error, okay? So what happens is, let us say when we are using um, an Eclipse and in that we have opened a project. So there are lots of metadata about the project, okay? Like uh, some of your preferences, some of your log files, some of your settings which you have uh, you know, for a particular project, or let us say how you set the encoding. Basically, there are lots of uh, um, settings related to a uh, workspace. All those settings are stored in a directory called dot metadata, okay? By convention in any operating system, if any directory is, or a file is um, starting with dot, okay, or a period, then what happens is with your ls command or dir command those will remain hidden those will not show okay so these are the dot uh, dot uh, directory or dot files are generally the files which are created by the system or the or for by some uh, framework or software for the internal use not by the user okay so in this situation what happens is let us say your um, eclipse crashed or your um, um, or your, uh, you know, the operating system crashed, something un, um, unwanted happened actually. So in that case, what happens is inside the dot metadata directory, there is a file called dot lock. So whenever a particular workspace is in use, there is that dot lock file to tell that, okay, this particular workspace is already in use. And if somebody, else or let us say if you yourself starts a different instance of eclipse and um, try to open the same workspace from another eclipse so that will tell you that okay there is already a dot lock file and it is already in use so you can't open it but if let's say because of some reason your eclipse crashed or your os crashed and the removal of that dot lock file at the closure of eclipse is not happening so what is the situation now that in your dot metadata, even though your Eclipse has shut down um, in unexpected way, but still there is dot log file. So when you are trying to open again, the same workspace using Eclipse, you will see this error. So now you have understood what is the problem. So I'm very sure that you know what is the solution for that, that you have to go to the dot metadata of, of that uh, workspace so this is how the dot metadata looks like. So I have just removed some of the sensitive part. Okay. And uh, you know, these are uh, the files like, uh, so you can see that there is a dot lock file. Okay. So you have to just RM that is remove the dot lock file. If it is in windows, you can just, uh, you know, uh, go through the uh, file browser and then just delete it. Shift delete this dot lock file and again, restart. If it is in uh, Linux, just um, again, type um, Eclipse command in the terminal and everything will work perfectly fine. So that is all for this session. And I hope you like this video and it would resolve definitely your problem of this error. And if you like this video, please um, like it, subscribe it, and the usual things like promote this video. That is how I get um, motivated. Thank you very much.